Hi guys and welcome to my channel. My name is Jarno and this channel is Learn French avec Jarno. And today I wanna I wanna teach you how to use these uh, l'imparfait et le passé composé. I won't teach you conjugations of verbs or how to conjugate uh, l'imparfait or le passé composé. No, but how to use these two. And 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 um, let's. Let's think about it. This is like a, like a, some kind of, you know, boom line there, you know. Uh, let's 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 make a kind of situation. For example, maybe you are in town, uh, at a coffee shop or somewhere, having your coffee, and and, and then then you can tell a story. Okay, uh, for example, um, oh, je lisais le livre. You can say, you can say, je, je lise le, le lief. Okay, so you were, you were reading, I was, I was reading a book, okay, I was reading a book, okay, or the book. Um, and then, then, like, boom, something happened, like, choo. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so you saw something. You saw something. Okay. Uh, je. Sorry. Je. J'ai vu. J'ai vu. Ta mère. So, so you were doing something. Okay. Je lisais le livre, and then oh. J'ai vu ta mère. So I was reading a book and bam, I saw your mother. You know, for example, this kind of sentences. And or you can you can change some the verb and change the accent what happened there. You know. But this was kind of thing you were doing there, and then this was like boom. I saw your mother. Okay. Um, same thing with with using these two about about for example reading. So you can say like uh, so so je je lisais le livre. Okay. So it means it it means that you you was reading the book, but it's it's not it's not finished the book. It's just you know the thing you were kind of doing, you know. Uh, uh, but, but but what comes to what comes to le le passé composé? If you say je je lu le livre, so it means that you actually you read you read the book. So so it's you need a new new book. You need a new book to to read now. So because you finished the book. So here you kind of you know you it's it's not finished. You just say oh, yeah, je lis le livre, okay? But je lis le livre, so it's over. Yes. Okay. When it comes to le passé composé, there is there is avoir verb. You use avoir, avoir and être verb. So these two you can form the you know the. the uh, le passé composé, but 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 it's a different different video. But I want I want you know you lo learn this form. You can you can tell about your life. You can use this boat. And here is kind of kind of you know boom boom. It's like a flash. Chew. Je lis le livre. Oh, boom. J'ai vu j'ai vu ta ma mère, maman. <laughs> okay. So this is the one way to 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 tell a story or or kind of uh, make a make a difference between these these two these two. Uh, okay, um, I don't know if you have a questions, leave a leave leave a comment and you can ask. Uh, but but this is a this is the one way to start to start learning. And of course, you need to know the conjugations and you need to know when to use. Être or avoir verb when you form the le passé composé, for example. Yeah. Okie dokie.
Yep. Thanks for watching and um, uh, alla bra sen. Vi